on the drive to California right now. Uh, wow, that lighting's terrible. Here we go! This is an incredible feeling. I'm definitely nervous. I'm definitely excited all at the same time. It feels great though to be on the road and finally heading in the direction that I want to be going in. And uh, yeah, it's thrilling. I've got a couple different places lined up. Just got out of Gainesville where uh, I met with my roommate who will be living with me in California, but he'll meet me there in about seven days or so uh, after I've had a chance to scout it all out. So it's gonna be fun. It's really gonna be a fun time. Uh, I think we're gonna get along really well. At least I hope so. So I'm actually officially heading west now. Uh, just took a left, headed towards Tallahassee, uh, coming from Fort Myers. So we're about about seven hours uh, so far into the journey. And we're probably expecting about 41 hours uh, with all the included stops, with all the included places that we're gonna end up stopping to go, to visit people, to stay at different locations. So about, about 3,000 miles worth of driving, which means a lot of gas stations. I got a good tip from a guy at the gym and uh, in Gainesville said I gotta stop at this place called Bucky's where it's a cool gas station. It's apparently the biggest gas station in the world so I'm really looking forward to that. I do have one problem though. Uh, I can't hold my camera like this the whole time. It's, it's gonna be kind of a pain. So, And I really only have one sticky mat. Let me explain what a sticky mat is. At a quick gas station here for two reasons. One, because I'm nearly out of gas, which, good mileage by the way. And number two, because showing this thing off while trying to drive is really a stupid move. Here's what it is. So this is a sticky pad, and unfortunately I only brought one of these, but what it's useful for, uh, you'll be very impressed by. So let's open this thing up real quick. The sticky pad. What this thing is basically is a pad that sticks. Since I don't really have a GPS or cool crazy screen here on my amazing 2004 Honda Accord, I almost thought about actually buying a brand new car just so I could make this trip, or, or at least leasing one. And, you know, having a GPS is really nice, and not having one is kind of sad and sucky. But, I found a cool way to fix that, and that's with this little pad here that I just call a sticky pad. It's probably not called a sticky pad, but I just call it any that anyways. You can buy them online for dirt cheap, luckily, and transform your car. So check this out. You peel it off, like so. You stick it anywhere where you've got a flat surface. You then take your phone, and it sticks to it like that. So now, you got a nice sticky pad that lets you do a GPS, lets you kind of go hands-free on everything. You can take calls or whatever by just pressing some of the buttons here. Super easy just to navigate yourself. And like I said, the pad, dirt cheap. But now if you're anything like me, you're probably saying to yourself, but Mark, I don't have a flat surface like that and I don't want to buy no stupid sticky pad thing. Okay, let's just take a moment there is a solution for you. So the next thing I bought was this little thing, which I actually got in the Verizon store. It's a lot more expensive, but you put a magnet on the back of your phone, you take it, ooh. So you got two sweet options without having to buy a new car, without having to install a new GPS. Oh my God, genius Mark. Thank you so much. You guys are so welcome. As an added bonus, I'm gonna put a link to it in the description below. So the sticky pad's also good for, you guessed it, putting my camera 
right there so when I drive it makes it super easy for me to talk, drive, and not have to hold the camera while doing this whole trip. So you can actually buy both of these products in the description below. Uh, it's actually really cool. Amazon does an affiliate program which I will have to show you guys later. Remember this channel is all about learning different ways to make money in an entrepreneurial fashion. So I want to be able to show you guys what are some of those concepts and one of the cool ways is actually Amazon lets you do an affiliate program for free. You can create a, an account and you put links to products and services and if someone buys it through one of those affiliate links you get a small commission so as a disclaimer, if you were to buy any one of these products, whether it be the sticky pad in any colors or fashion that you want, or the other thing that I just showed you, I actually get a small percentage of uh, that purchase price. Now, you're not paying anything more for it than you would have normally paid uh, on Amazon, so it's not like you're having to pay anything more, it's just that instead of all the money going to Amazon, some of that money actually goes to me. So if you want to help fund this channel, consider buying a product. In addition to that, I also want to mention that I will never review a product that I personally did not buy or don't use. I'll never put something on here that I don't think is worth the money. Obviously, the stuff that I bought, I bought with my own money because I thought it was worth it and they've all ended up paying off. And so these are tips and strategies for living a better life. And so I wanted to be able to share those with you guys here. So don't buy one just because you want to help fund the channel and you don't want to use the product. Buy it because you actually want the product. If you see something valuable, consider purchasing through the channel. But if you want to buy 100 sticky pads to give out to all your friends, I am totally cool with that too. Two of the two, obviously this one's cooler just because you could stick it on an air vent and it sticks really well. You could spin it sideways if you wanted, which is really cool. But this one's really economically affordable and could be the better price. Or you could just buy both, tell you the truth. Why not? Just buy both and be cool like me. I got two phones, one for the plug and one for the... Mmm, gosh, smell that beef. Yes. Oh, it's a perfect meal for the road. So I'll make a video about the affiliate links in Amazon in a later video. I just can't do it right now because I'm on the road traveling. If I wasn't going across the country, I would make a video about it so you guys can see how to set up an account. It's not very hard. Anyone can do it. And you make anywhere between 4 and 10% off of anything that people buy through your links. So, I swear, if you buy one of these products and you don't use one of my links, I'm going to be mad. I'm going to be very mad. I will say this, though. In order for me to keep those links, I have to at least sell something within 180 days. So, if I can sell at least two products a year, I can keep those links I can keep that account and I could potentially make like 50 cents or something this is just a good idea something to think about if you have a website if you have a blog Amazon affiliates program there's a great way to sell products that you don't have to manufacture you don't have to warehouse you just have to be able to do the referral and you can make a full-time income off of it but you gotta sell a lot, as you can imagine. We are about 10% of the way into this entire trip. We're just about to pass through Tallahassee. I tried to go all the way to Tallahassee to fill up, but I was running out of gas so fast that I was worried I'd have to push my car the rest of the way to California. And we don't wanna do that. We definitely don't wanna do that. This beef jerky is so good. just used Airbnb for the first time. It was a little scary. Almost lost $1,500 from a scam artist. Again, I don't know what it is with the scam artists and traveling. 
and Craigslist and all this stuff. It's it's scary. So I will see you guys in Baton Rouge.